For years I was pushing my body beyond its limits physically and mentally. For years pushing mentally, phys physically, do you also face similar kind of issues? Yes, yes, yes. I have heard lot of people saying yes because I myself have been through this stage once upon a time but not anymore because there is a simple three step formula you just have to follow. Trust me. Repeat sentence, you will never complain saying you have problems. If you really want to know more about this three-step formula, make sure you watch this video till the end. Hey everybody, now I'm from Skills PT Academic. Really hope everybody is doing fantastic. I'm back with at another super awesome power-packed video on repeat sentence. That is three-step formula to get that 90 out of 90 in PT speaking and especially repeat sentence. Before we get into the video, if not subscribed to this channel, kindly click on the subscribe button. And anytime you need online assistance, it's a paid assistance. You can check the information in the description. There is a link given, WhatsApp link. You click on that, it will directly come to us. In the WhatsApp, I'll be there, we will be there to help you, guide you in the right direction. All right, without further delay, let's straight away get into the video and let me unveil you about this simple three step formula. Here you go. Repeat sentence hacks, three step formula. So, before we get into this three step formula, let us understand what is repeat sentence. Something like this will be given. They play an audio, it says beginning in three seconds, two seconds, one second, audio plays. Please come to the next seminar properly prepared. After that, you will have some time. Remember this very, very important. You will have some time here, beginning in one, then recording. One, 1 1.5 or two seconds delay will be there, after which there would be a beep sound, sometimes no beep sound, after which the recording will begin, one bar, two bar, one bar will start, immediately you should start speaking after you see this recording. The moment the audio ends, mic will not be on, you have to wait and then speak once the recording is on and once done, immediately click the next button. If you do not speak for first three seconds after the recording is on, three seconds over and you did not speak, after that the microphone will turn off, you will not have a second chance to give or submit your response again. That is all repeat sentence, repeat sentence contributes 30 plus marks to speaking, 30 plus marks to listening because you are listening and speaking. This is an integrated module, this is available for both PT academic and PT core, very very crucial module and trust me very simple module, it is a very simple module. Um, all right, let us understand how you are evaluated because the evaluation criteria is something that gives us or you know like gives rise to this three step formula. Pearson says for PT academic or core it is the same, it is the same software, same center, everything is the same except for one or two modules. You are evaluated with respect to fluency for 5 marks, pronunciation 5 marks, but content is not 5, content is 3. Meaning content is not given priority, but all the students will practice every day trying to give 100 percent content, means you are running but in wrong direction, the direction is this, this, I mean the destination is somewhere over there, but if you are running in this direction, will you ever reach the destination? Probably you will after some time realizing taking a U-turn. So, with this we will know content is not a priority, it is the fluency, 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 smooth flow of speech, whatever the way the speaker speaks with respect to speed and pauses, the same way you are supposed to speak in repeat sentence. Pronunciation do not have to worry too much, pronunciation is not going to give you mark, it is the clarity. When they say pronunciation, it all means it is clarity of your speech. When you speak, you need to open the mouth clearly and speak, do not have to copy the accent. Let us do some math. This is what Pearson says, if you give 100 percent content, means whatever in the audio you spoke everything correctly, 10 words were there in the audio, I spoke all the 10 words correctly, you end up getting 3 out of 3 content. But fluency if it is bad, you will get 0 there, you will not get full marks even if you speak 100 percent correctly. This fluency and pronunciation should be perfect. If the content is only 50 percent matching, you do not get 0, you get 2 out of 3. If less than 50 percent or nothing matches, Pearson says 1 out of 3, it is going to be 0 mostly. The point what I am trying to tell you is this, 2 out of 3 for content, 5 out of 5 fluency, 5 out of 5 pronunciation. If you belong to this category, meaning you are speaking only half or you are speaking only 60 percent of the data, then probably it is 5 plus 5 plus 2, 12 out of 13. One repeat sentence is not 13 marks, one repeat sentence is 3 mark. This 12 out of 13 is 
you know equal into x by 3 for 3 marks what is this for 13 marks it is 12 for 3 marks it will be 2.88 something it is 3 only from our observation even if you speak 50 percent or 100 percent you will get same full marks to listening yes to speaking yes this is what we have observed that means this is what we need to consider for this what is required a three step formula very simple formula we will continue now you will understand but before that the problems that people face first problem I can't speak more than eight words if eight words are there I am the perfect I am the boss if it crosses eight words that is where the problem starts I fumble a lot when I speak content and all I remember but when I speak b b b b all this happens sometimes I do not understand the words at all words are tricky accent problem and so many things etc 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 remember when you belong to these two accent problem and I do not understand the words it is basically because of your listening skills listening skills have to be improved how do you enhance your listening skill listen to a podcast watch a tv series English every day for 20 30 minutes automatically this problem is fixed but every day without fail you do it for one month or 15 days 10 days two weeks you see a great difference you will not have trouble understanding or trouble having these two problems problem fixed but these two I cannot speak more than six words I cannot speak more than eight words for those people trust me this formula that I am going to unveil will help you sorry that you know I, I kept you waited but trust me it is worth the wait what is the three step formula very simple things step one listen to your capacity see when I say listen to your capacity first you should know what your capacity is is not it so my capacity is probably 14 13 words someone's capacity could be 20 words someone else's capacity could be 5 words it is ok it does not matter if your capacity is only 2 words then I cannot tell but at least 5 6 words should be your capacity 5 6 words you can read in man. come on is not it so so know your capacity take some random 10 questions and just see how many of it can you retain in your mind if there are 10 words are you retaining 10 words confidently or 6 words 7 words I think on an average 6 or 7 then write it down this you should know these people do not know themselves because people are only busy practicing correct you should turn inward and understand what your capacity is this requires a bit of effort a conscious effort probably half an hour effort 5 minute effort one day effort put it understand what is your capacity and then you come to step one I will listen to only my capacity that also I will tell you how to listen 90 percent of them listen full that is where the problem starts you listen more problem 100 problems you listen less no problem <laughs> okay I will explain you what is meant by listen to your capacity but yes if your capacity is six words you gonna listen to only six words after that the audio is there but you will not listen that way you should be trained step two understand and analyze see it is a listening skill let us say you speak Hindi let us say you speak Arabic let us say you speak Tamil Telugu Malayalam if I play the audio in your language just try to observe you will not memorize you try to understand because you know the language it is English you know English do not push it away understand and analyze this is where you are trying to get a picture of it when you get a picture it will be there trust me on this if you do not get a picture that is a problem and then step 3 produce smooth flow smooth flow smooth flow smooth flow smooth flow for this you need to convince your mind try to speak effortlessly do not try to put a lot of effort there while speaking see right now I am just speaking the words that are coming out of my mouth are just flowing but when I try to speak with a lot of effort uh, all these things will happen it should just flow this you need to train no matter what I will not fumble I will just pronounce properly I will just let it go like you know the water that runs in the river this is the three step formula but implementation is not so easy boss please hold on we will show in the end it, it is a small video not gonna be a another I mean like five or six minutes not more than that so please wait patiently till the end I will show you how I implement this step one step two step three in just a while again let us recapitulate listen to your capacity let us say your capacity is six words you listen to six words if the audio is ten words after sixth word you will not listen to it you can do this or you can just divert your mind or you can recite the six words because anyhow the audio is playing the microphone is off you decide if your capacity is six words listen to six words not more than that if there are four words then bingo you will speak all the four words no need of any test of formula once you listen to six words understand and analyze probably you just have to watch the words probably you just have to understand what these words mean and all it will take some half a second or one second 
and then produce smooth flow visa without hesitation. I will just implement this three step formula right here, wait for it. This is the audio. My favorite childhood memories are of making and eating dumplings. My favorite childhood memories, dumplings, this is what I heard. In the middle hour of a dub 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 something came. My childhood favorite memories, dumplings. This is what I need to speak now. Hope you are getting it. See, I will just explain you again. Listen to your capacity. My capacity is only 6 words. My favorite childhood memories are of making and eating dumplings. Are of making and blue or something came. I just chucked it. In the end, I just waited for a simple word dumpling. Now, I will speak. My favorite childhood memories, dumplings. Do I get marks? Definitely, yes. Content. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. My childhood favorite memories, dumplings. I am speaking 5 out of 10 words and all those 10 words, 5 words are clearly pronounced. My favorite childhood memories, dumplings, this would be 0. You think you spoke 5 words, nothing is clear because software understood only one word. It is always better to give 2, 3 words extra to be on the safer side. But what exactly I did, I understood, I listened to the 5 words. R of making and eating, it was not clear, so I just checked it. But this word, I heard clearly. I understood what it is, a dumpling, could be a momos and then produced a smooth flow just the way the speaker speaks. My favorite childhood memories are Look at the speed, my favorite childhood memories, dumplings. My favorite childhood memories, I am not going fast. My uh, ch favorite uh, child childhood, I am not doing it. This requires a bit of practice. See where problem happens is, when you try to speak everything. The first thing that you need to convince your mind is don't speak all, don't listen to full. That is where hundreds of problems, hundreds of problems starts. Listen less. What is that less mean? Listen to your capacity. This is where you need to put that conscious effort. I will explain you one more. We have got some couple of questions. Let us do this. The market for electric bikes, scooters and mopeds is expanding. The market for electric bikes is expanding. See, I can speak full the market for electric bikes, scooters and mopeds is expanding. I can speak full, but let us say my potential is less, then probably the market for electric bikes, scooters and mopeds After that, I will not, not listen. The market for electric bikes, scooter and mopeds or or the market for electric bikes, enough, do not listen, do not listen, is expanding. is expanding. The market for electric bikes is expanding. See, at the end of the day, your role is to get that fluency perfect by giving some of the content. If at all you are able to produce these 10 words well and good, you do not need any 3 step formula. But the problem is if you are not able to speak those 10 words effortlessly, then the market for electric bikes, scooters and mo mopeds or market for electric bikes, scooters or market for electric bikes, scooters is expanding, market for electric bike is expanding. I am trying to listen first half or first 60 percent or 40 percent, 20 percent. In the middle I will not. It depends on you. Listen to your capacity, this you need to master. This probably I think I have mastered because of so much of experience teaching this for over a period of for a stint of 5 and after 6 years now. Hope you are getting it. See the problem is this, this you need to consciously categorize. I will listen to this, I will listen to this, middle I do not. How do I decide now? This comes with the experience. The more you practice with this approach, the better you become over the time. If you do not follow this approach, simply practicing, eh, nothing is going to happen, I am telling you, because it is a wrong approach, 1 plus 1 is equal to 3. Every day, if you are practicing with that logic, do you think ever you will be able to solve a bigger mathematical problem? Correct? This comes with the practice, it is all about whatever you have listened, you will speak. But when you listen full, it is difficult to speak full. So, listen to your capacity. But the first step, the first step, you get it, you get things right. Work towards the first step. Probably it will take you one day or two day. Just practice, just practice, just observe. Listen, okay, listen this, I listen this, I'll not listen this. I listen this, I'll not listen this, I listen this. I listen this. First 50 percent, first 60 percent, first 20 percent, last 20 percent, first 20 percent, middle 20 percent, last 20 percent, first 40 percent, in the middle I don't last 10 percent. Depending on whichever the word is difficult, your mind will react. You just have to train it. We'll go with one more question. Fires caused by lithium ion batteries are vicious. Fires caused by lithium ion batteries. That something vicious. I know the word. If I am not confident, I will not even listen. 
fires caused by lithium ion batteries. That's it. I spoke fire caused by lithium ion batteries. If I say fire instead of fires, do I lose marks? See, don't worry too much about the content. Worry about pronouncing smooth flow of speech with crisp clarity. Fire caused by lithium ion battery. Vicious. This will not give you mark. You should be crisp and clear just the way the speaker speaks. Don't run fast. Don't run slow. Don't have to produce the accent of the speaker. Just copy the speed and the pauses. We will go to one more question. Ready. For years I was pushing my body beyond its limits physically and mentally. For years I was pushing my body beyond. Enough. Or for years I was pushing my body mentally. See, at the end of the day, it all depends on with what ease you speak. You could observe me here, I am speaking very calm, composed and I am listening to my capacity. For years I was pushing my body. For years I was pushing my body. For years I was pushing my body beyond its limits physically and mentally. For years I was pushing my body mentally, physically and mentally. For years I was pushing my body beyond its limits. Anything is fine. 13 words are there. At least speak 7, 8 words. No? For years, I was pushing my body actually enough beyond its limits. Or for years, I was pushing my body physically and mentally. I was pushing my body physically and mentally. Do I get marks? Yes. Still yes. If I miss this, yes. But do not intentionally interchange. You can't. Let it go in the order. In some cases, if you are not able to follow the order, well and good. It is okay. It let it jumble up, but do not do it intentionally, worst case scenario. Can I speak for years? I was pushing, I was pushing, I was pushing, I was pushing, I was pushing like this. No, 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 do not speak that. Can I speak for years? I was pushing, I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you. I do not do all these nonsensical things, man. Every day they are updating. For a 50, you want, you can do it. For 65, 78, 79, I do not suggest doing it. All right. Let us go to the next one. Ready. The demand in the market, both in diabetes and obesity, has just stepped up. The demand in the market has just stepped up. Easy peasy. Do I get knuckle really marks? Can I trust you? Definitely yes. I know what I am doing. But if you fail to implement this way, then marks will not come. What I mean is the demand in the market. Let's say you suppose the demand in, in, in the in, in the market has just stepped up. This will not give you mark zero. Or you can say the demand in the market, diabetes and obesity. That's what see, try to try to master this tactic of listening to your capacity. I'm just trying to listen to my capacity, I'm not listening full. In diabetes and obesity, the demand in the market. That's a phrase. Obviously, it will continue. So I have an option to listen to it or check it because one more phrase is going to come. The demand in the market, something and something has to come for sure. The demand in the market. Both in diabetes and obesity. That's it. The I demand in the market, that both that. in diabetes and obesity. The demand in the market, diabetes and obesity. The demand in the market, both in diabetes and obesity has just stepped up. Well, people who can speak all 14 words, continue doing it. But if you fumble, you're going to get zero. I'm telling you, let's say you spoke. The demand in the market, both in diabetes and obesity has just stepped up. This is going to be zero. Do not assume boss. All the hero and hero and so resuming. I have to get full marks. Last exam I spoke that. I have to get full marks. You do not. You will get zero because software cannot understand. It is an audio match. There is an audio. Whatever you speak, it should match. It is not matching in terms of fluency. So, obviously, God case. Focus on the fluency, not on the content. So, in, in order to focus on the fluency, you need to listen less. You listen full, 100 problems. Listen less, no problem. Something of that. I think I have got one more audio. I am not sure. No, that is it. All right. I really hope I have done justice to the time that you spent on this channel. If you feel the same, then leave your valuable comments in the comment section. Like, share and subscribe. Anytime you need online assistance, you can WhatsApp us any point of time. I will be there to guide you all. This is Nakul. And A K U L Nakun signing off from Skills PT. Soon I'll be back, guys. Till then, take care. Bye bye. Thanks much.